Bismillah Rahman Rahim. My name is Nur Saeed and welcome to my YouTube channel. So again, this is an end-to-end e-commerce product recommendation system using machine learning and floss framework. So this is a whole project. You can update it. There is also an add to God option. Uh, you can clearly see these are the top trending uh, products. You can see we have also added add to God functionality. Apart from that, we have sign in, sign up. I'll show a bit later. But if I go to main page, there we can search a product. So I have searched this one and I want for now five recommendation only or six, let's say five. Okay, six, five. Okay, so search on the button and you can see our system recommend uh, five products with images. We are also getting the images. Okay. Uh, but if I search another, here you can see one image is missing. So if in case we have a missing image, those ke liye hum kuch is ka sorry photo liga sakte uh, Let's try one more. Now this time, me aap pe ten products search karna chahta hoon. To jaise me search pe click karunga, you would see now this time we have instead of five top ten recommendation for this one okay so basically we are going to implement all these things but before that also let me show you that we have a setting option you can change the theme like black if you want something like green so you can also do that if you want zoom in or zoom out so yeah this function functionality is also included Apart from that, we have a sign in page and we have a sign up uh, page. Okay. Uh, project ke liye, we will be using XAMPP MySQL server for database. Uh, but before that, we will get a data set and we will train top four models like top rated recommendation, content based recommendation system, collaborative filtering recommendation system, and Finally, hybrid recommendation system. I will also try to add the new part in the recommendation system, the five part, which is known as multi-model recommendation system. So believe me or not, but you are going to learn everything about recommendation system, uh, e-commerce website creation, so all this stuff. So let me go to home. And in home, you can see here we have a background video. After that, these are the top trending recommendation because first time user aata hai we don't have a uh, new user history so in that case we have to show the top rated uh, products but once you go to the main page then you can search and all those things uh the database is as i said uh product db ye bhi hum dekhenge so let me show you uh, a sign up so main sign up pe click kiya the user let's say noor said and email is noor at the rate of gmail.com and the password let's say for now abc so sign up uh, you will see the message success user signed up successfully if i go to database or database ke andar agar main sign up table ko reload kar do this is the user you do mene pehle add kiyo hote but this one noor said with this password okay you can clearly see now if you want to sign up sorry sign in then uh, username what was the username uh no said so no said let's say the password this time let's say i want wrong password and let's see what the system says uh user sign in successfully uh no it should not be like that just let me check if I go to sign in table. Okay. So we have a validation by issue R we will see that later. But yes, you can sign in as well. So yeah. This is the project. Now in this project, what you are going to learn? First of all, you will learn. A Jupyter notebook code. 
where we will be getting uh, e-commerce product data set <clears throat> and for that data we will be doing pre-processing like cleaning the data and we will be creating a new column by the name of tags and we will be extracting different tags and keywords from different columns like product description product name uh, brand all those stuffs uh, after that we will be uh, getting the top 10 trending uh, top rated uh, products and we will be displaying right here you can see with this functionality okay uh, but if you user want to search like content based or search based and for that we will be implementing content based recommendation system using cosine similarity and some other techniques we can also do one user similarity with other user like collaborative filtering and if you want to combine all these then we will be implementing um, hybrid recommendation and if you want something new like multimodal recommendation system which is quite in a research base recently i will also try to add that one so yeah that was the introduction now see you in the next video